Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Xenoblade Chronicles 3. So in the last episode, we had rescued Valdi from the console queue and we also had a battle with him, which we won from. And we were able to destroy Colony 30's flame clock. And now, we are just going to gather information about the colony. Okay, and I'm pretty sure I can't do anything else in the game until that has been done. So, just time to look around. Let's get some information here. So, refreshing to not that console. We may not be here to manage things anymore, but we'll cope just fine with UZ around. Right, so the colonies no longer have support from the queen or the castle, so as their flame co clocks are cut off, as I'm aware. Use it. So, some new person we're gonna learn about, it seems. Widge Widge. Da -da -dun. Good to add more Give names. me in on all that information. Okay, anything else over here? I am going to be spending a lot of time with Valdi to make sure that everyone has access to his class at some point. Right now it's only Lance, but I will be grinding a few special enemies in order to get that up, like I did with Ethel. And Rip Papa. Yes, give me all the information, because we're already at almost rank 2 with Colony 30. The more the merrier. Zuza. Everyone has very interesting names. I love it. <laughs> Good to add more names. Yes. Oh, and we can also check the affinity chart. I totally forgot about that. Uh, Michelle. Michael? Mi Michael? Michael is usually spelled with an A in it. Good to add more there's gonna be a lot of stuff. I'm gonna have to do a lot of shopping later as well. Ooh, I actually have to do some gem crafting. I haven't done that in a bit. Something Cook some food. Ta -da. Give me some more information. Ooh, fortune clovers. Oh, is that what uni liked? Fortune clovers? I thought gifting was gonna be a thing in this game. Turns out not, but I guess gifting was kind of annoying in the beginning. Oh, you know what? I should probably level up just a little bit, just in case. We could do with some food. Oh, I'm not here. Let's okay, I'll do that later then. Let's see anywhere else. I'll buy some stuff later. Just want to make sure I get everything since I cannot leave the colony just yet. What are you saying? Right. Okay. Any others? Uh, I'm, I don't quite know what they intend to do with having so many heroes in the game. Like, you look at them, it seems there's at least 10? Maybe more. And how are they all gonna tie into the story? At least they are doing something pretty interesting with the commanders. It's not just you go to a colony, you help look a commander and the colony, and then that's the end of it. At least we are getting some benefit out of it so we can appreciate that it's just with how many there are is the question all right time to head back time to head back okay i thought i saw this thing over here what is this what is this here we go oh a container nice wonder what's inside Thank you, thank you. I've not spent any of these Nopon coins yet. I'm kind of saving them for a bit. That's probably the best thing to do. Uh, don't want to go there. We're trying to go this way. I want to make sure I know how to properly use these Nopon coins before I do anything with them. As I'm still kind of getting the feel as to some other handy mechanics in the game. Right, I think that's pretty much all the relevant news we can find. It seems the problems are far more prevalent than we'd anticipated. Tell me about it. So, what's our next step? I think we could do a lot of good here by helping out. But ultimately, our destination is Sword March. That's important too. You're right. We should consider things from all angles before we act. 
pulses of freeing pluses of freeing colonies. Liberating a colony will enable you to access a wealth of new information. Be sure to check every nook and cranny to gather up all the rumors you can. Staying informed as the story moves forward, the information you can obtain will also change. It also it's always worth revisiting colonies to gain up to date information. Well, we can't go back to Colony 9, but will the game let me go back to Colony 4 is one thing. Uh, we should probably learn some information. And if it will let me skip travel, I will also see if I can pick up any side quests as well, because there are a bunch that tasty. we have access to. Alright, let's first discuss all this new information that we got. Okay, widespread I think custom. We need to discuss this. People go crazy for collecting fortune clovers in Colony 32, don't they? You used to collect them as well, didn't you, Uni? Yeah, only got four though. Are they lucky because they're so hard to find? Bingo. I don't know where it came from, but they say if you find seven, they keep death away. Based on what? Hang on. There's not much point in a me mechanic picking up seven of them to ward off death. They're non-combatants. Yeah, they're less likely to die in action. Eh, I don't know if there's anything to it. Why is Ven collecting them then? Ven from Colony 30? Oh, you think there's a good fortune clover spot somewhere a mechanic can't reach? Yeah, I guess that might be what I think. Class. What say we go we go ask around? Looks like uni is gonna add to a collection, huh? <laughs> oh, side quest. Nice, okay. I'll probably do that at some point as well. I think we need to discuss this. Valdi, aren't you Kali 30's commander? Ooh, okay. Have to do his voice. <clears throat> yep. It's just that people in Colony 30 seem to really rely on this use it guy. Oh, and how? Use it as my aide. He takes care of a ton of jobs for me. What do you actually do in the colony, Valdi? Uh, build Levnesses? So basically, you leave all your commandery duties to your poor mate. Uh huh. He really helps me out. Valdi, are you really okay with that? Weren't you gonna figure out the best way to protect everyone? If you're gonna do that, don't you need to keep more of an eye on all these things? Uh, oops. Yeah, I think you're right, Lance. I don't think I could do his voice. <laughs> right, so, what do you want to do? Hmm. You said, well, no, I bet. Let's go talk to him. Oh, wow, there's a lot to do. Seems this will be a very side quest focused episode. I think we need to discuss this. Alright, what do we make of this news about Kali and I possibly being under threat? Even if it's just a tasty rumor, I don't fancy leaving anything to chance. I agree. If we really are up against a large battalion, there could be a lot of casualties. What I want to know is, why now all of a sudden? It's just a theory, but I'd imagine that they consider this a particularly opportune moment. Striking when the enemy defenses are at their weakest is one of the oldest tricks in the book. Hmm. Only thing that fits time-wise is our is us becoming Ouroboros. So what? Are you saying it's our fault? Well, it is possible. In any case, it wouldn't be launching an attack on the scale without some kind of justification. We shouldn't go and help them. We should go and help them. If we hurry, there might still be a chance. Yeah, and we'd never forgive ourselves if we missed it. Okay, let's go and talk to the commander. If we work together, we should be able to keep casualties to a minimum. I just hope they'll believe us. If not, we can always try a different approach. Well, if that's settled, then I believe our next stop is Colony 9. Though it would be far from our deal, we may end up having to stave off the enemy attacks by ourselves. Yeah, best be prepared. Oh, and sorry for getting you wrapped up in our affairs. Don't worry about that now. Let's just do what we can. Right. Oh boy, a lot to do, a lot to do, a lot to do. Let's bounce. Okay, now I assume this means that I have 
access to skip traveling. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go Valor, back. Is that Levness? You want to see? It's still a work Where? in progress. Which one? Well, I can give you a little sneak peek. Over right. there? Okay. We need to get back to the cliffs where we met Valdi. Okay. We can make sure we're in perfect shape by replenishing supplies at Colony 30. We've got the time. As I was saying, what I'm going to do is I'm probably now going to cut back and see if I can pick up any past side quest and see if I can complete any that I already have and then we'll be doing the side quest that I've acquired just now so this is gonna be a very questy episode okay okay I'm heading back to this dehydrated no pond because I believe I can finish this quest now all I have to do is give him one item and he should be good what we handing over? yes we'll give you this armor chestnut and you should be free from your thirst. Ah, Petty Petty eternally grateful. Friends are good friends. Don't mention it. We're just glad you're okay. But what actually happened? Why are we all passed out in the first place like this? It's a story of great length, so Petty Petty choose not to tell it. Fair enough. That's fine by us. It all started when Pane Pane on way to Veronia's Hulk on it. Hulk? Yes. On hillside where apprentice wait. Pane Pane fall and belonging smash. He's gonna tell us anyways. <laughs> Everything except hammer, which Pane Pane carry on back and take it and broken by monsters. Pane Pane flat broke. Pane Pane has last legs, walking, walking, and no drop to drink. Oh, and so you are gonna tell us. Okay. Shil Shil, apprentice of Pane Pane, must be so looking forward to meeting. Thanks to friends, Pane Pane has saved. We'll rest teensy bit more and then go see apprentice. Well, don't overdo it. The roads are dangerous. No worries for Pane Pane. Legs of Pane Pane are very fast for running away. That won't do you much good if you're horizontal. Anyway, Pane Pane save now and Pane Pane pay you back. <laughs> Thank you. Completed quest. Huh. Would you believe it? Alright, so let's see what we can do first in Colony 30. It seems there's quite a bit. I want to make sure we get this done first before we do any side quests because I have a feeling I might need to be a much higher higher level before I do certain side quests. Oh, you! Little birdie told me you collect fortune clovers. You could say that. It's the colony's pilots, especially the fourth squad. They're just so reckless. Just yesterday, someone... How many more will we lose before I get a full seven? So he's collecting them for the pilots. Are you a collector too? If so, you want to get want to go to Laprel Knoll. They're often found around there. Sweeta. Always nice to see a new face. Consoles are sure seem like marshalling massive levenses. Oh, this is just information. Okay, let me activate this quest. Okay, activated this quest. Let's see where I have to go. Around here. Wish upon a clover. Okay. Skip travel. Gotta make sure I avoid the red exclamation point. Alright, headed this way. Hmm. My god, there's gonna be so many side quests to do. It's gonna be some time before we get along with the main story, so just as a warning, the next few episodes are all just gonna be side quest and hero quest based. Uh, if you're only here for the main story, sorry for that, but I am a completionist. I try to do every single thing that I can in a video game whenever I pick it up. Okay, let's see how this is gonna go. Oh, this looks like Prime Prime Fortune Clover Country. All thanks to Ven, no less. 
Should we bring him one as thanks? Oh, good shot, love. Did you complain about Senna calling you love earlier? Now you're going around and calling other people love? After I've staffled just one as commission. Oh, I'll help you find a clover, Uni. Manana also searching. I haven't done a Manana in a while. Oh, hello. No right now. No right now. Please no. No right now. I don't want to fight you right now. Not a good time. I think I might have to though. Ah, ah, ah. Where am I looking? Where am I looking? Ah! I'm going insane, I swear. Okay. Oh, is the mission really not gonna end? Here we go. Fine. You really wanted to? Okay, let's finish this off with a chain attack. Alright, I'm gonna go with... Let's go with Lens. And I'll start off with the Defenders. Just to raise that TP a little bit. And then Uni. I'll get some of the healers in later, so then I can finish this off with either Tyon or... Noah. Ooh. Okay, let's do... You. Okay, and then we'll finish off with Tyon. Everyone has such cool animations, it's great. Cool. Okay. Go in, Senna. Um, we'll go in with you. Forty-five. And then I'll go in with Mio, since she's a healer. Hopefully, that'll bring it up a little bit. All right, and finish off with Sion, because I don't think you count for the making sure. Uh, I want to change phrase. Uh, no, not a machine type. Okay, we'll go with you. Oh, I used the wrong one. It's okay. Bravo! Nice, nice, nice. We got a higher percentage, which means we should get another. Oh, but he's already dead. All right, no reason to continue on this chain attack then. Uh, except for the EXP, but I don't really need that right now. <laughs> Is this, like, a rare thing? Okay, let's head back to the colony, which I was intending to do from the start. Hello, Ven. Hey, Ven. I found fortune clovers over at La Prelle Knoll. Oh, good news. When work's calmed down, I'll go over and look for some. Yeah, actually... Here's one I picked earlier to thank, to thank you for the heads up about the spot. Are you sure you don't mind? Thanks. That's three, I think. <laughs> May all the lovenesses from Squad 4 come back unbroken. Was this... not for the pilots? What, those lumnock... lumboxes? Uh, they're good for... all they're good for... Wait, all they're good for is breaking perfectly good lovenesses. Incompetence, ugh. Um, right. Got you. <laughs> okay. All right, so we've got that standard quest out of the huh. way. Would you believe There's it? one more over here that we can do. So let's go ahead with use it. Use it. Guess what? Wait, what voice did I do for him? Can you not see that I'm working? I can see, and thanks for that, by the way. Well, as long as you noticed. Anyone else having trouble telling which one is the commander? Use it. Let's do something. Oh, you want to do something, do you? We need to restore calm to the colony. That takes priority. Has there been any unrest since that flame clock was broken? Would I call it unrest? Oh, the nopon are going whack. That's what's happening. 
It's just that now the fighting has stopped, and Levna's maintenance isn't so vital. Everyone's whining about how they got nothing to do all day. It's driving me up the wall. We're all looking for something to do, me included. I need to work on his voice. Oh, everyone can pitch in on Doric. Doric? Is that this big Levness? Yeah. I said I'd make it the best Levness there ever was. That's the one the console ordered built? Will you help me with this? Ahem. <clears throat> Mama, Riku supposed some advice not go amiss. Yay! I can't stop you working on it, but you can't raid our materials for it. Understood. I'll keep salvaging stuff myself. Guys, let's build a loveness. What exactly do we gain by finishing it? Nothing. But as long as it keeps him up unhappy, he'll be doing me a favor. He's not very commander-like, but he does care about the colony. We can help out with scavenging materials. What do you say, Lens? You're gonna help? Yeah, go on. I'm the one who told you to find something to do. Thanks. Rep- Repapa's the one in charge of the Doric project. He'll be able to tell you what's needed. Cool. Always nice to see a new face. All right, got a lot of this stuff to do. Let's find out some materials. Vladdy's been great That's help. Nice. Ripa, 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 thank you. As befits chief. Chief? Vladdy trained as mechanic alongside Ripa under Master Pon. Basically, her papa look after Vladdy a lot. Right now, his Doric and Mecha friend, and also look after use it when have time. It's so good, Chief. Anyway, friends say friends want to find materials. They're very kind. What shall we do? Meh. First is get lots of materials from Atea and Furanus regions. Materials needed throughout Shek, so bring first to Repapa. Area around Colony 30 full of stinger piles. Ripe for taking. Get quit picking. Dang it. Gathering that? quests? Okay. Uh, Mecha friend. Great. Everything looks to be good order. I can rest easy. Huh. Would you believe it? Oh, I meant to talk to you. Have friends found materials? What okay, let's see what I have. Ah, darn it. Okay, this is probably something I'm gonna be collecting off screen for now. It's not enough yet. Rep any plenty more materials from Mate and Ferranus regions. Always nice to see okay, you okay, guys. okay, fine. Hey guys, Future Crypta here. Just wanted to let you guys know that I did complete the hero quest that unlocks Colony 9, and that will for sure be the next episode. However, I did want to include the Big Friendly Friend quest in this episode just because I thought it suited the topic of the video. So, for oh, sure, look forward to that. Everywhere. That will be included. But I just wanted to make sure that this quest stays on topic. Okay. Okay, that's gonna be all seven stinger piles. Now all that's left is to get the shell. Is this like a rare thing? All right, that is the last shell that I need for the big friendly friend quest. And I'm just going to go ahead and complete it now. Okay, back at colony 30, I have everything I need to complete the first round of the big leaf Big friendly friend quest. Let me just go ahead. So I have already given him these twice of the Splendor Stinger, and I'm going to go ahead and give him the last one with everything that I've just collected. Okay. Three, two, one, and complete. All right. Is this good enough? Oh, ho, ho. phase two completed. Thanks, everyone. Phase two? Meh, so far where Papa only cobbled together parts on hand. Finally, can build all important section. 
Then phase three start. It's finished in no time if we work like this. Just wondering, how much further is there still to go? Oh boy, there's gonna be quite a bit. It finished at phase 10. You what, mate? We say we help, we see through to end. Sounds like someone started enjoying himself. Doesn't it? Nope. Oh ho! -ho. Keep collect material and bring to her papa. Doric's going to be the protector we've always needed, our mighty guardian. Yeah, can't wait for it to be done. Just watch me go. Okay, I don't remember the voice I did for Valmy. <laughs> <sighs> well, no one likes fetch quests, but it's here. Yeah, even I'm not a big fan of fetch quests, but big friendly friend is we complete. Yeah, we can take it slow. Thank goodness. Well, it's gonna bother me that this quest is available. All right, let me talk to him. See if I have any materials for this. Make a friend really put shy. Oops. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, let's see. Nope, no materials. Okay, for sure I will be leaving this quest for a future episode, so don't worry. No more, no more time traveling. <laughs> All right. In the meantime, I've just went ahead and added some arts and skills to everyone, and as well as added some gems and crafted them. I've also done stuff to the interlink skill tree, but here we go. Everyone is now leveled up. I've added the Tailwind 2 to everyone. Uh, not sure if that's the most optimal gem or right now but it's early game so what can you really expect so i've just went ahead everyone has their second art on the left side of the palette same thing we have valdi over here okay and let's go over to the inner link i've also done some stuff to the soul tree i've just unlocked whatever was the most available and i like to stay consistent on the paths i don't really like to go too far in on any one sort of section and same thing, switched out just a couple arts, not very many on uh, Lance and Senna. I just added in their Titan Fist art because I felt I would probably get more use out of that. And same thing with Tyon and Uni. Just went ahead and added Ether Collider instead. And yeah, let's see what we can do in battle with these different arts and where everyone's all added up and has a bunch of new arts to choose from as well as classes i went ahead and changed everyone's classes for what was ranked up okay while i was also crafting gems i was able to acquire some information on glitter radishes back over at the beginning of this new land area so i'm going to go ahead and discuss that with the group you see glitter rashes growing all over the place in the Faranis region but yeah, no joking. At first I thought it was just some kind of weed. That offensive against radishes everywhere. Glitter radish is not only delicious, but also cover all bases nutritionally. The misapprehension is understandable. They do not tend to spread like wildfire when they're in season. Ugh, that brought bad memories, and not the good kind. You use these glitter radishes quite a lot in your cooking as well, don't you, Manana? Very muchly. Glitter radish even add aesthetic appeal, making for very good and versatile ingredients. Only need peeling, as skin is tough, and also to take out stringy bits. But after boil for a few hours, and be sure to strain out scum layer, and yes, very tasty. Sounds like a lot of work for a radish. Want to eat, but tough to eat. That is what Manana called dilemma. Eh, uh, doesn't bother me. I'm a simple man. If it's good, I'll polish it off. <laughs> then Lance can take peeling duty. If not have to work for joy of eat, then pleasure much diminish. Uh, what? Sheesh, can nobody take a joke these days? <laughs> that didn't sound like a joke to me, Lance. Alright, that's everything I have to discuss okay. for now. Next on the list Let's see, is anything else in the colony I could possibly do? Oh, I should probably cook, so actually. Order food. I would like to acquire some recipes. Let's see, fish fillet. Mm, Gather some spoils. Oh, look at everyone eating. Except for Tyon. Tyon's not so eating for some reason. 
Nice, got a new recipe. Okay, I have to make sure I go back to any other canteens and see if I missed any as well, just so I can have that in the log if I ever need them in the future. Okay, and with that, that will be the end of this episode. I know it's a bit of a short one, but the next content coming here on out is going to be way long, and I did not want to have to split different parts of a story into different videos. I would rather have keep it condensed into the same one. So, with that, I have completed a few Colony 30 stuff, and everything else will be for the next episode. But don't forget to like and subscribe, and you could also follow me on Twitter and Twitch at crypto underscore agate for both of them for any other content. But until then, see you next time.